Hey guys, Rob out here and I'm always in hotwater.com and boats in hotwater.com trying to squeeze in one more listing uh, before the Thanksgiving break and uh, I'm already booked with closings uh, the next two days and we're out until Monday. So this is the second game fish of the day. I just listed a 2020 game fish 27. What we have out here today is a 2016 Game Fish 30 with coffin box. And this is, uh, there's really no mystery here. Uh, my detailer just left and left and just did a topside clean, so it looks pretty. And let me see if I can get in a little closer so you guys can see. Carolina Blue Hull. Um, obviously, I can't see underneath the vessel. I'm not a marine surveyor or climb down or dive in to check the sides for you but from what I can see all the way around and dipping my head down without dunking my phone in uh, exterior of the vessel looks great single owner boat like I said I don't I can't see underneath now this boat is bottom painted and uh, there is a we are in a closed lock system with filtered water here so, you know, there's a diver that goes down on the boat monthly, which looks like he is due from what I can see. And I'm going to, I got to pan back out to give you guys a, sorry. Um, I can see a little bit of growth right there. In this marina, you tend to get the worms. So you got to kind of keep up on it. Um, it's minimal. You just don't want to pull the boat out and uh, have that harden up on you. You guys can see the windlass. So overall, clean boat, only 175 hours. Quick note, there is no trailer available in the sale of this vessel. This is where it's been since it was purchased. And there are also no liens and no holds on this boat. It is free and clear. We have clean, actually no clean titles. It's a USCG documented vessel. This vessel is USCG documented. Our engines are model years 2015. Uh, the hull was manufactured in 2016, but it is uh, 2015, but it's a 2016 hull with a 2016 hull ID number. And as far as warranty on the engines go, and these are twin F300 XCA engines, I did pull the covers off for some pictures. I want to keep them protected. As you guys can see, that's doing a real nice job. Uh, the seller and me, we are waiting on the dealership that we purchased from to send us the warranty cards for this boat. Um, so I can nail that down, see if it's extendable. I know you get one transfer, and if they are extendable, then we'll see. If not, um, it'll kind of be a crapshoot. Like I said, it would be a three and three. Might be under warranty, might not. I'm just gonna go with the standard three year warranty and say the engines are not covered at this point, but I will find out. Worst case scenario is I go to my other dealership and punch in the serial numbers and find out exactly where. You guys can see the Garmin uh, Open Array a XHD2. The boat's clean. Um, I have no issues with upholstery. Um, you know, no stress cracks from what I can see. Please remember, if you guys want to take a quick look in here. Lumar windlass. Um, oof. You know, I'm not a marine survey. I'm also not a marine mechanic. We have service records on the boat, obviously. Uh, you know, you're going to have a couple of ticky-tack little things like right here. I haven't tried the stereo system, but clearly that speaker there <laughs> has gotten kicked a few times. Uh, you have the side entry door, as you guys can see. On the back end here, on this particular cushion set, not as much, maybe a little bit on this one. Got a little bit of color fading. Uh, nothing you'll freak out about, but that's from that sun hitting it here. And this one is definitely a little bit lighter up in this area, but we're not dried out or we have no seams. Um, ripping or anything on the upholstery she's in pretty good shape as far as the center console it's very well protected in some of the pictures you'll see uh, we have a complete covering for it which I have to put on as soon as I leave but overall just a clean uh, boat the sellers just had some life changes and the boat's sitting you know you got to figure 
a 2016 boat and you've only put 175 hours on it insurance and costs and service and everything else you know it's if you're not using it it's time to sell it beautiful beautiful boat real nice shape icon vh marine we got a ic m324 infinity stereo let me see if i can just okay not the best music in the world stat speak is working it's working let's see what we got going on over here negative no surprise there all right let's turn that down all right that's off uh, we got a GPS map 7612 XSV obviously you have your Yamaha you got your fly-by-wire here your Lenko trim tabs your Optimus uh, steering setup uh, your I would assume your remote windlass setup and you know there are there is some room if you want to make some improvements or things along that line so overall um, I think probably like I said outside of not having a trailer I think the seller said that the boat is probably due for bottom paint it you know it might even have the original bottom paint on it but we in if we are in a filtered water system so that is all up for discussion obviously I didn't check those speakers so misters anyway you guys know the boat if you're looking for this kind of boat it, the specs that I put up are going to be almost the same as the manufacturer's website and like I said 175 hours on the engines you can't go wrong there so that'll about do it like I said a beautiful 2016 30 game fish twin 300 engines 175 hours no trailer US Coast Guard documented uh, gonna need a new speaker over here and possibly some bottom paint if you're gonna be picking it in the water and a trailer if you need one so Rob out here and I'm always in hotwater.com wishing you guys a great and safe boating day Rob signing off be safe out there on the water have a great Thanksgiving